G'day, Stu here and welcome to the UAV Futures Flight School where we aim to show you guys how to fly a drone with step by steps from beginner all the way up to pro pilot. So enough rambling here in the studio, let's cut out to the field and get on with today's lesson. Alrighty, let's get on with today's lesson, a pretty exciting one and a trick that a lot of people like. It's called the power loop. It sounds kind of complex and uh, it might look a little bit tricky, but trust me, it's super easy and once you practice it a few times, you're gonna be nailing it. Essentially what it is, it's where you take your quad, you go through, you do a loop to loop and then your quad ends up back where it's started. So let's waste no time, let's jump in, have a look at the sticks and get started. Alrighty, now this one's pretty simple, let's have a quick a slower look on the sticks. We're going to be going through the gates and then all we're going to be doing, we're going to start to pitch backwards and that's by holding our pitch back a little bit. It's going to look like we're going to do a, flu a flip, but as we do it, we're going to keep our throttle on and that's going to push us all the way backwards to, sort of to our upside down and then we can finish our loop by letting off the throttle and just sort of holding our pitch stick where it is. So it's a pretty super simple maneuver, it'll probably look something like this. So we go through there, up on the throttle, lower the throttle and then pitch back to center. All right, let's do it while we're actually in the air. Now something that's worth mentioning as well, you're gonna find this a lot easier if you've got a little bit of camera up tilt. So you can see there, I've got mine at about 45 degrees. So that's gonna make our power loops a lot easier. So when we're upside down and coming in, we can actually see where we're going. Anyway, let's get to it. Okay, so let's hit my arm switch. Up we go. And I'm gonna go over here, see I've got these two gates set up. That's where we're gonna be doing it. You want somewhere nice and straight, pretty nice and easy. You know, you can go over objects a little bit later, but it's gonna be good if you wanna practice in somewhere like this. So we're gonna line up our gate. We're gonna go through, I'm gonna do one first, and then I'm gonna talk us through the other ones. So this is a really big one. And then we're back in. So it's all like a loop to loop. All right, so let's go through, and it's probably easy to think about it like we're hands on a clock. So here we go, we're gonna go through. Pitch back, throttling up the whole time, off the throttle at about midnight, midday, whatever, and all the way back. Now that's another really big one, but essentially it's pretty easy. You just hold that throttle till you're upside down, and then you're off. So that was a little bit better. Let's try one with a little bit more speed and we'll try and make it a little bit tighter. So watch my thumbs here, but when we get through, watch what happens to the throttle and also the pitch. So throttle's off. I'm using a little bit of law, yaw to line me up and then that would have been perfect if I went through there again. All right, so going through the first gate, second gate, power loop. Alrighty, and if you've done a really good power loop, it'll be perfectly in line. Anyway, practice this for a few batteries. It's a dead easy trick. I know it feels a little bit scary because you can't really see where you're going, but trust me, after a little bit, you're gonna be nailing them. You're gonna be able to do in some really tight little places. And then you can add a roll in there if you're feeling a little bit cheeky. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that. Subscribe for more FPV related content. Everything I talk about too, I'll link down below in the description for like your beginner quads, radios, all that sort of jazz.